and in my kitchen today we're gonna make coconut chocolate fudge it's incredibly easy to make with only four ingredients it's healthy yet rich and delicious it is an absolute winner with everybody I've ever served it to so to begin with we're going to use something called creamed coconut creamed coconut comes in the form of a solid block it's actually almost identical to coconut butter although you will find that if you buy creamed coconut in a block then it's almost always less expensive than coconut butter we're going to use about half a block and first of all I'm going to cut it out of its wrapper and for this recipe we need about half a block which is 100 grams so we're just going to chop that up into pieces and then pop it in a pan so we want to melt the coconut oil gently and we should find that that's going to melt within about a minute we want to try and prevent it from burning in the pan we want to make sure it's just melted and if we start to see it bubbling we turn the heat right off Okay, so this is just melted and I'm helping the melting process by pressing any remaining lumps in with the back of my spoon. And then we're gonna add one teaspoon of vanilla extract, three tablespoons of organic maple syrup, two tablespoons of cacao powder. Now make sure that you buy organic and fair trade just to support ethical cacao and chocolate practices if you can't find raw cacao powder just use a good quality cocoa powder that's just purely cocoa and then just stir that in until everything's mixed nicely together you might feel it starting to thicken up as the ingredients begin to dance and entwine that's when you know it's perfect what i'm going to do now is i've found a container and i'm going to line it with parchment paper I'm just gonna jam pack the coconut chocolate fudge into the parchment paper. And then I'm gonna press that down firmly. It's kind of squishy and squidgy at this time. And the other thing you might like to do is take a little bit of desiccated or shredded coconut and just sprinkle it on top for an extra bit of poshness. And then you can pop this into the freezer for about half an hour or the fridge, maybe about the same time. Basically what we want to do now is we want to bring the temperature right down so that we can set the coconut and set all the ingredients. Allow just a little bit of time for the ingredients all to infuse together before we eat it. All right, so it's been about half an hour and it looks like my fudge is ready. It's really nice and firm, slips very easily out of that parchment paper. Now, as you can see, it has this incredible, rich, fudge-like texture. Mm. That feels incredibly transcendental. If you like this, then you will absolutely love my book, Angelicious. It's jam-packed with over 110 deliciously healthy vibrational raising recipes, and it has two dessert sections. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Trinity. You can subscribe to my YouTube channel, come visit me on Facebook, and join me on my website, trinityskitchen.com. Stay tuned, and bye for now.